Are you an RVer? We're gonna find out right now because I'm gonna give you a test. Hello there, how are you? Welcome back. I am Dr. Dave, the RV dummy, and I've got a great one for you today because I have a lot of different types of people watching my show. Some are RVers, some are people that are thinking about getting into RVing, some have an interest, and we're gonna give you a test right now to find out exactly where you stand on that spectrum or in that spectrum. Before I get into it real quickly, and by the way, you wanna get out a piece of paper and a pen, a pen, pen and a piece of paper, pencil, have it ready to go. We're gonna go through this real quickly. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Before I do, um, I did a test last episode and it worked. And so I want to ask you another favor because when I ask you to like, you give it a thumbs up, like the video, before you forget, before we get into it, just give it a quick like. It really helps the channel a lot, and our cat Boo Boo will get to eat a good meal if you do that. So make sure you click the like button right now before we get started. Also, my Facebook page, The RV Dummy. Go check it out, The RV Dummy on Facebook. You get up to the minute updates when I'm gonna be live streaming. And by the way, if you're brand new, we do a, a, a new video here every Tuesday morning. It comes out, but I try to live stream, if possible, once a week, generally on the weekend. I try to do it on Sundays, but sometimes we have to change it around depending on the scheduling. So if you join the, um, the Facebook group, you'll get updates. But the best way, the absolute best way to get updates, to find out la the, right away in real time when I'm gonna be live streaming is to join my VIP list. And all you have to do is send me a text to 801-893-3810. I'll put it right down here as well. 801-893-3810. Just put, just say VIP and I'll put you on the list. I will never spam you. I'll never share your phone number with anybody and I'll never use it for anything except a last minute update to make sure you are included in something. But other than that, I'll never mess around with it. So you're totally safe with me, the RV dummy. Let's get right into this test. We're gonna go fast. Make sure you have a piece of paper in front of you with a pen or a pencil. If you don't have it, press pause right now. I'll wait for you, for you to get it. And we're gonna have 10 questions. And I want you to not, not Google, not research. I want you to go through honestly and answer these questions right now. We're gonna start. Did you get your pen and paper? If not, press pause, If and when you're ready, let's go. Question number one, that's gonna be multiple choice, so all you have to do is write down the letter of the correct answer, the one that you think is the correct answer. Question number one, black water is A, a great RV song by the Doobie Brothers, B, wastewater with poop in it, C, Dangerous standing water in the roadway after a storm. And D, a radioactive type of water that is not potable. So write down your answer. Just write down the letter A, B, C, or D. Number two, a fifth wheel is A, a safety device to prevent a motorhome from driving erratically in the wind. B, the nickname for the famous RV drink sold at many campgrounds. C, an RV that is towed with a special connector to a pickup truck. And D, the spare tire. Number three, remember, just write down your letter answers. We're gonna go back and check these off the right answer. I'm gonna read off the right answers at the end. I'm gonna grade you and let you know where you stand. Number three, a motorhome that mostly resembles a tour bus is A, a class A, B, a class B, C, a class C, and D, a class D. Number four, driving with the propane tank open, A is normally acceptable as long as you have the optimal safety binder. B is fine if you are away from a major city or tunnel. C, is permitted if you are running a class D refrigerator, and D is not safe and not recommended. Five, winterizing your RV is A, necessary in climates where the temperature will fall below freezing. B, is greatly overrated and not necessary. C, necessary only 
in a deep freeze or snowstorm. D, dangerous because antifreeze will seep into your drinking water. That was number five. Number six, just write down your answers. Number six, campgrounds will not accept an RV older than 10 years old. A, true always. B, sometimes true. C, false always. D, only in California or Oregon. Seven, most electrical systems in RVs are A, 20 amp and 30 amp. B, anywhere from 10 amps to 75 amps. C, auto converting from 120 volts to 120 amps. And D, 30 amps or 50 amps. Let's go into number eight. Solar power in RVs, A, is a great way to keep your coach batteries charged. B, is not advisable as it is not permitted in some states. C, is not yet available. D, is generally sold by multi-level marketing companies. Nine, RVs with diesel engines, A, are favored by campgrounds, B, are very dangerous because of the fumes coming into the coach, C, are actually not recommended, D, none of the above. 10, our final question, except there might be a bonus, so hang in there. 10, in general, the easiest rig to park in a regular parking space is A, class A, B, a class B, C, a travel trailer, D, an Airstream. Now I've got extra credit for you, extra credit question. Ready. I became a VIP on the RV dummy by texting the word VIP to 801-893-3810. True or false? Let's go back and correct your, and give you the correct answers. And I want you to make a little mark every time you get a correct answer. We're going to count them up the end. I'm just going to give you the letter. Um, I'm not, so, okay, we're not going to have to go over and, and repeat the questions. But um, question number one, oh, I'll give you, I'll give you the question real quickly and, and the answer. Question number one, black water is, the correct answer is B, wastewater with poop in it. Number two, a fifth wheel is C, an RV that is, Towed with a special connector generally to a pickup truck. Three, a motorhome that is most that most likely resembles a tour bus is A, a class A. Number four, driving with the propane tank, the correct answer is D, is not safe and not recommended. Number five, winterizing your RV is A, necessary in climates where the temperature will fall below freezing. Number six, Campgrounds will not accept an RV older than 10 years old. B, sometimes true. Sometimes true, although I will give you the caveat, I've never had the problem. My, my RV behind me is older than 10 years old. Never had a problem. Number seven, most electrical systems and RVs are D, 30 amp or 50 amps. Number eight, solar power in RVs is A, a great way to keep your coach batteries charged. Number nine, RVs with diesel engines. The answer is D, none of the above. None of the above. Number 10, in general, the easiest rig to park in a regular parking space is B, a class B. And number 11, give yourself an extra credit if you said true, that you became a VIP by texting VIP to that number down there. So here's how to score yourself. If you got 10 correct, if you got 10 correct, you are definitely an RVer. If you got eight to nine correct, you're likely an RVer, but you need to brush up a little bit, just a little bit. If you got five to seven correct, congratulations, you're likely looking to buy your first RV. If you got three to four correct, you go camping, but you probably use a tent. And if you got zero, one, or two correct, Congratulations, because even if you guessed totally randomly, you should have gotten, mathematics says you should have gotten at least three correct if you guessed randomly. So if you got zero or two, one or two, 
You are very, very special. Let me know how much you enjoyed this episode. It was a lot of fun. Um, Dr. Dave, the RV dummy, welcome back. Remember, a brand new video about RVing or life comes out every Tuesday morning right here on this channel. And I try to live stream. When I live stream, we have a really good group together and we talk to each other, we answer each other's comments, we kind of kid around. We just have a great time. There's fantastic energy from the RV dummy community here. So catch my live stream. It's generally Sunday evenings. I try to do that, but again, it could be changed around a little bit, but the VIPs will be the first to know exactly, exactly when I plan to live stream. And if there's any updates, I, I will text you back and let you know. So make sure you join, become a VIP. Until next episode, and by the way, if you haven't subscribed yet, press that little subscribe button right over yonder, right there. It's, it's down there. Don't forget it, it's there. I'm Dr. Dave, the RV Dummy. Namaste, see you later.